Hi you guys, it's Mrs. Buitermeentje. Me on a regular after work <laughs> uh, type of uh, look. And I'm back here with Burda of December 2020. So this is the last edition that I am going to get being that my, my subscription was only for six months and i have already had six of these i posted august which i'm going to put the eye right there and i posted november the eye is going to be right there when you finish with this video you can go ahead and check out those and i'm just giving you my first impression so i'm officially opening it and i'm already seeing something that i like it is 43 patterns, it is 6 dollars 6 euros 95 and it seems like it has a Scandinavian charm and some trendy pieces and yeah, basically it's more in a theme of the holidays. So let's get into it. As you know, I'm going to skip the overview and we're just going to see what catches my eye. Oh, 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 I'm sure about this one. This is pattern 105 um, A and it's a skirt with like a bow detail in the front. Wow, it is made out of stretch cotton. Wow. I already know. <laughs> okay, good one, good one. If I do buy, if I would buy this, this magazine, it would definitely be for this skirt because this skirt right here, wow. Okay, so we have a dress, like a gala dress. It's also very nice though. It's also very nice. But I, uh, I don't really have those types of occasions to go to. So it's just a mental picture. So they have some leggings in here, some skirts, but the dress is definitely a go. And this t-shirt also. I always am, I'm always loving a coolette though. This one's a cute one too. Okay, and just, let's just look in what else. Mmm, mmm, get out. Wow. Okay, so this is still the, the skirt. This is pattern 105, but this is version B. And they made it out of hounds. Is this houndstooth? I think so. Um, No, it's not houndstooth. It's a... Uh, that's French name. I'm going to put it in the screen. But wow. And how they style it. Mm. Wow. I love that. I like this dress. And I like how they style it as well. So you can take it from summer to winter. Uh, which is nice. So this uh, dress is pattern 102B. And they made it out of a black fabric. Out of a polyester stretch. Oh, uh, so that could be a fuscose. A fuscose, yeah, okay. And it has like these uh, bully, oh no, balloon um, sleeve. It has a pleated skirt. It also has some details in on the bodice and some in a V neckline. I like it. I wouldn't do it in black because I do have pets and so cat hair and dog hair is going to be all over the place. Um, but I like that they styled it with a turtleneck under it. And so you guys know I made a turtleneck from Seamwork not so long ago. Um, that would be a nice option to mix them two together and be like, oh, well, I could, you know, tr transition this, this dress. This is really cute and with some tie high boots. That's nice. I think I might put this one on my winter fashion mood board though, because I do like it and it is something different, something that I wouldn't wouldn't make or wear, to be honest, but I do like this. Mm, this might be something that I can make for my hubby. Yeah. So this one was my last one. I'm not going to renew my subscription. I'll probably go back to just checking, um, just seeing if I like something in the store. And then it wouldn't be a real first impression. Well, then it's a second impression. But, um, yeah. 
yeah, let me go back to, oh, let me go back to the uh, overview and then I'll tell you exactly how much things, how many I liked. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six, wow, seven, yeah, yeah, this one is worth it. <laughs> In my opinion, this one is worth it. So as always, I enjoy making this video. I hope you enjoy watching. Don't be afraid to comment down below if you have any questions or just want to say hey. And you have a great, great day. Bye.